I spent a lot of time wandering the galaxy by myself. There was nothing holding me down after the Red Devils were disbanded. I was searching for something to live for other than my work, but nothing really stuck. Until I heard about the Terramorphs on Tau Ceti. Old habits die hard. <laughs> What's up everyone, it's Sister Citizen, and today we're going to be talking about one of my favorite companions in the game, one that I actually had no idea that you could even have as a companion until someone in my community let me know that you could. Now before I get into how to get Hadrian Sanan as a companion and some cool side missions to do with her, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe as I'll be doing a full series of videos on all my favorite companions in the game. Hadrian Sanan is a researcher and former Xeno Warfare military scientist who worked with Dr. Percival Walker during the war. I won't be giving away any spoilers to those who may not have played through this Vanguard quest yet, except to tell you that in order to recruit Major Sanan, you'll need to visit Commander Tulwala in Atlantis and he'll give you the mission Grunt Work where you'll proceed to Tau Ceti Gourmet Production Center on Tau Ceti 2. I won't give away any more than that as far as the quest line goes, but after you complete the mission A Legacy Forged and then head back to Atlantis to Commander Tuwala to basically recap the quest line with them, you can then return to the TMD headquarters on Mars and speak to Percival Walker. He'll give you the option to speak with Hadrian in order to persuade her to travel with you as a companion. And as a side note, if you're a fan of Hadrian's outfit, make sure to look around her office when you go talk to her to pick up one for yourself. Now after convincing her to follow you, make sure to return to Percival as he'll have some really awesome missions for you gathering samples from creatures on planets that you may have not even thought to land and explore good, good. on yet. I know just the species. Uh, let me get you that info. Here, that's where you're headed. Take care of yourself out there. They don't pay a whole lot of money, but the creatures Percival sends you to find are always interesting, sometimes very challenging, and always at an interesting point of interest. I enjoy taking Hadrian on these bug hunts, I like to call them, for some fun RP given Hadrian's Xeno Warfare background and stats, which include Pain Tolerance, which reduces her physical damage by 10%, Energy Weapon Dissipation, reducing her energy damage by 5%, and Xeno Sociology? Uh, allowing her to force alien creatures to stop fighting for a limited time, which is a pretty cool ability. She will occasionally give you bio samples and will tell you stories of interesting creatures she's encountered in specific systems. Mm, that's a tough call. I've seen most of the creatures in the settled systems, and there are plenty of strange ones. One of the most memorable was an insect-like predator I encountered on a remote planet in the Moloch system. It hunted by sucking the oxygen from the atmosphere around it to suffocate its prey. Isn't that fascinating? I've yet to venture to one of these systems to try to locate the mysterious beasts she speaks of, but I definitely plan to. I'd be curious if she shares more locations if you do find it, and if not, this would definitely be a cool feature for Bethesda to add to the game. If anyone has gone looking for the creatures she mentions and finds them, let us know in the comments below if she shares any other locations for some good bug hunting. Hadrian will get upset and stop following you if you hurt any civvies or UC personnel, However, I find her demeanor quite pleasant as she never makes you feel bad about carrying your burdens and her voice acting is superb. Not a good look on you, Captain. But I am grateful to be here. Leaving the TMD behind was the right decision. I hate to admit it, but 
You and Percival were right. Don't you dare tell him I said that. So make sure not to miss out on having this awesome follower on your team and make sure to take her along on those Percival missions. I guarantee you'll have a blast discovering new planets and creatures with your very own Xeno Research and Warfare Specialist. If you enjoyed this video and found the info in it helpful, make sure to hit that like button. And if you'd like to see more content like this, subscribe. I try to make helpful videos each week about Starfield, so I hope to see you here or in the stars. Peace. One of my favorite aliens in the settled systems is native to the Archimedes system. It's a massive xylophagic creature with almost impenetrable armor. They look dangerous, but they're actually quite gentle. When I visited their homeworld, I followed a herd of them for days without any problem.